hey guys I wanted to shoot this video out to you today and uh, on this video I want to talk to you about enlightenment and what it means to be enlightened to me to Isaac Ben Abram and I discovered along the way that there are multiple things that develop enlightenment now let's first touch on the mind because enlightenment and life itself with joy is said to be a natural state just one second guys I'm actually gonna put my grounding I'm gonna plug in my grounding part, part port here because I think it's important for me to have my grounding technology on while I'm talking to you so anywho Okay, so what you ought to know is we have a mind, right? And they say that enlightenment is the natural state uh, of mind. Now, what is the mind? The mind is actually an energy force that's around you. You are connected to it. An intelligence that's moving through life. It is around you, it's throughout all your chakras, and it is part of who you are. You are a conductor. You are a channel for energy, for frequencies that develop the different patterns within the mind itself. The mind is a universal mind, but yet you have patterns within the mind that then create different colors and emotions and perceptions and patterns. So, what, uh, what I've discovered is that in order to be enlightened, which means allow light to flow through you, to be light, to be that which is light, you must learn to honor yourself and really to need and how do you do that well you got to be able to process what you're going through and then you got to realize what's truly stressing you out if you sometimes feel like you can't relax you can't be still you can't connect to yourself you have too much going on to your in your mind well there is a very very good reason for that and it's not just because there's something wrong with you it's not because you're not used to meditating it's none of that I have discovered that I am not able to truly process what I'm here to process because it is coming from a different place. It's not, there's nothing really for me to process. What I realize that's happening is that my body is getting distorted. My body, my, the frequencies of who I really am is being distorted by unnatural electric magnetic frequencies. What I mean by that is that our body is a conductor. We are channels. So whenever you put an unnatural pattern in that process, you're going to get stressed out. You're going to get emotionally disturbed. And people may not make the link between the two, but I promise you right now that if you start to get grounded, you will not need as much emotional therapy. You will not need to do all of these crazy stuff you're doing. If you eat a raw vegan diet, you get grounded, you drink good water, and you have good air. If you have the four basic raw needs met, you're meeting the four elements of what you're part of. You are an effective conductor that receives all the life force energy that it needs to have all the insights that it needs, to have all the love that it needs. It's all right there, but we gotta be able to access it. That's key. If you don't access it, you are deprived from it. And then you think that you have something wrong with you and all these weird emotional, you know, uh, drama and patterns kick in and then you think you have addictions and you go for all these different addictions and all these weird things that, that happen when you are getting disturbed energetically. So this has been my discovery. And if you truly want to get enlightened, then practice what it is that will allow you to naturally be enlightened by taking care of yourself. So if you put raw foods in your body, raw food nutrition, you're raising your frequency and then you're getting the free electrons from the earth and, uh, and you feel more connected to the earth. And then you realize that your health becomes more about you know, you are as a conductor, having enough minerals, having good water in your body, right? Because you are made of energy. So if you take care of yourself energetically, 
then everything else will be taken care of. So if you start to, to, to view everything that way, and you start to honor everything that way, then your health will improve, your physical stamina will, you'll get stronger without even doing anything, and like without exercising even, you will also be able to focus better and have all the inspiration that you need to move into new levels of height in your life. So that has been a true discovery that I have about enlightenment. And I believe that if you apply these things, you have the same experience that I do. So till next time, live well, live with passion, and get grounded.